Alrighty bros, I hope you've all been enjoying your day so far today. I wanted to do something a little bit different for a video today and let you guys know how you undervolt your CPU. Now this applies to both laptops and desktops. And the reason that you want to do this is to cool your CPU down. If you don't have that good of a cooling system in your main PC, or if you're using a gaming laptop, which is what I'm gonna be making this tutorial on, then you want to undervolt your CPU. You're not going to be losing any performance with whatever it is that you're using. It's just going to cool the CPU down. Now, I do want to say if you go too far with the undervolting, then yes, you are definitely going to be losing performance on your computer or your laptop. But if you only go down by like negative 130 or negative 125, which is what I ended up doing with the CPU that I have and my Dell G5 gaming laptop that I just barely ended up getting, I have the i7-8750H inside of my gaming laptop, the Dell G5. So that is what I'm using in this tutorial. So if you have a laptop with the i7-8750, then you can just use the exact same settings that I have in this video, which is negative 0.125. And that will make it so that your CPU is about 10 Celsius degrees lower, which makes it so that you're gonna get better performance on your laptop or your desktop. I would imagine that most of you that have a gaming PC are not going to be you know, worrying about a cooling system or anything like that, because even if you have a potato cooling system, your CPU isn't really going to be overheating that much. Now this Intel Extreme Tuning Utility, you can overclock your CPU with this as well, but in all honesty, I would just recommend that you learn how to use a BIOS and then use your BIOS to overclock your CPU. But anyways, guys, that's gonna bring us to the end of the video. I know that it is very, very short, but I do not want to make a 10, 15 minute video like I had to watch in order to figure out how to do this. Once you undervolt your CPU, you can do a benchmark and you can also stress test your CPU. And a really awesome thing about this Intel Extreme Tuning Utility is once you get a stable undervolt with your laptop, it will permanently save it. I know that there's another program, I can't remember it off of the top of my head, but there is another program that you can use, but every single time that you turn your computer on, you're gonna have to do, you know, you're gonna have to undervolt your CPU again. This Intel Extreme Tuning Utility, you will not have to do that. You just save the profile, and if it's good, you do the benchmark and you do the stress test and nothing is happening with your laptop or your PC, then you're good to go and it'll permanently save everything. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Remember to support it with a like if you did. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.